Hello and how are you? I hope that you are having a fantastic day. Today we're going to talk about Bitcoin news and it's 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 been shocking. The entire cryptocurrency market is in turmoil because Bitcoin is down to $1000 per coin. Is $100 next? Unprofitable miners are shutting down. They're unplugging their machines and they're escaping this crypto disaster. And the TPT token is up over 1,123% during this crypto crisis. Wow. It's been an evening. It's been a massive one, uh, 24 hours. Unbelievable. Let's get into it. So this is Bitcoin trading for beginners, ideas to help you take profits and avoid losses. Can we get 99 likes on this video? I'm not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. This is my opinion. So we're going to start with CoinMarketCap. CoinMarketCap is a great place for you to get cryptocurrency pricing and trading information and so on. And today's top performer is the TPT token, the toilet paper token. And when we click on this link, it takes us to the website and they've got their wipe paper. Wipe paper has been released uh, into the wild. And uh, just as a little introduction, the evolution of modern day toilet paper has come a long way. Before the invention of the double triple ply squares, Human civilizations used a wide range of objects that could be sharp and even dangerous to their anatomy. Throughout the years, rocks, corn cobs, and pieces of wood were utilized while softer solutions like communal sponges were used by the ancient Romans. The wealthy preferred fabrics like wool or lace that posed less of a threat to the body's vulnerable parts. So I'll leave you a link to uh, the white paper if you'd like to read the rest of it. In other news, uh, Parade is showing off your inner jokester with 60 outrageous April Fool's Day pranks. So obviously this is my April Fool's Day video. And here in this article is 60 different April Fool's Day's pranks. The first one was create Brussels sprout cake pops that look super appetizing but become quite the super surprise at first bite. Fill up a donut box, you know, something like the obvious Krispy Kreme or Dunkin' Donuts with veggies inside and listen to the reactions uh, from your co-workers or at home. Many of us have certain shows that we have to watch with our spouse or roommate without jumping ahead, so go through that episode list and start playing the show a few episodes further so they think you've gone further without them. When you sit down together, later to watch, try to keep a straight face as they realize something is not right. And so they go on with some others. And then I have another list with 11 April Fool's pranks. Uh, this one is kind of cute. Glue pairs of Google eyes <clears throat> on every single item within the fridge so the condiments appear to stare back at you when someone opens the door. Uh, booby trap, affix a party popper, yes, the kind of dollar store item that you can buy for New Year's Eve, to the jam of a closed door with a string attached across the door. So when someone turns the knob, they'll find themselves surprised by a loud noise and a mini explosion of confetti. This one was uh, quite, a, quite interesting. It's a, it's a dirty diaper. So you get the classic baby diaper and you fill it with melted chocolate inside. They, I saw one where they even talked about, well, right here, tasting the mess. So <clears throat> quite, quite an interesting one. This one is about putting bubble wrap underneath a carpet. And so uh, it, they go on and on. There's quite a variety of them. So some interesting pranks. I'm gonna have links to all of these videos uh, the all of these websites, sorry, the April Fool's pranks uh, down in the description. So if you're interested in learning more about the uh, toilet paper token wipe paper, you can read about it because we'll put a link in the comments below. Uh, just click so that you can get to the YouTube channel. The YouTube channel is where those links will be. 
In the meantime, how can I be of service to you? Do you have any thoughts, comments, criticisms? Uh, do you disagree with anything that I've said on any of my other videos? Please leave those comments and, and uh, reactions uh, in the comment section below. In the meantime, I hope that you'll like, subscribe, and hodl. And do me a favor, have a fantastic day.